The ODM grassroots elections kicked off in various parts of the country, where party members were to elect delegates at the village level before moving to the constituency and county levels tomorrow and Saturday respectively. But it was not all smooth sailing, as contestants for various party positions and their supporters in some wards differed over the voting process. While some favored the secret ballot, there were those comfortable with queuing behind their preferred candidates. Sisi wana ODM, ukanege matope na mugu mwe campaign door to door. Leo hii ikuwe mtu atoe pesa ilifu msini ilifu miyamoja, a campaign na yo kwako, ageuze watu na pesa. Tunajenga party ama tunafunga party. Ule mtu mwenye amekuja kutu preside over as the presiding officer, amekuja na team ya the components. Of which wamekuja na wakasabu watu, atuka tumesikiza na ni mambo ya mulolongo. The party's election board, keen to avoid a repeat of the violence that was witnessed during the party's last grassroots polls, said it would arbitrate whenever disputes arose. Some feel that uh, those who are able, uh, councillors and others, may have used their, office, their offices to influence the results. And we, as a party, we have said, we will listen to every complaint. In Mombasa County, political rivalry triggered by contestants eyeing the governor and senator posts found its way into the polls. Two rival groups in Changama constituency, one allied to area MP Ramadan Kajembe and the other to Suleiman Shabal, differed on the voting system. Kajembe and his supporters favored the Mlolongo system, while Shabal insisted on secret ballot, prompting the latter to boycott the process. Azimio la kwanza tumeukata hu uchaguzi kabisa. Azimio la pili tutakwenda kotini kudai hakizetu na kusmamisha hu uchaguzi. You cannot attempt to say a process is flawed even before it happens. So therefore, the best thing is to allow the people to choose the sort of leadership they want. The electoral process was conspicuously slow in parts of Rift Valley. A majority of the region's members of parliament, led by Eldoret North MP William Ruto, have all but left the party and are now associated with UDM. ODM leader and Prime Minister Raila Odinga hopes to use the grassroots polls to chart a new cause and to weed out rebel members of parliament who have accused him of dictatorship. The elections board said it is keen to ensure that there is no interference in the process by the rebel members of parliament. And we have mandated our people at every village at the grassroots level to know who is an ODM member, who is a mole, and who, who belongs to the other political parties. So that when they do the election at grassroots level, they know this is not ours. After the constituency and county elections tomorrow and Saturday, the party's national officials will be elected on Sunday. Some of the listed party national officials who will not seek re-election include Chairman Henry Kosgei, Vice Chairman Aden Duale, and Deputy Leader William Ruto, who are linked to the UDM party. The Orange Party seeks to use the ongoing grassroots polls to popularize itself and also put its house in order. It also seeks to weed out members who have been described as rebels as it prepares for next year's general election. Francis Gashuri, Citizen Live at 9, at the ODM headquarters.